if you're just uh, browsing on Twitter what Kramnik says, <laughs> what Annie <laughs> says, then it's not really quality time. You know, like let's say you work six hours on chess, but half of it is on social media, then you only work, work three hours. But I think, I mean, there are some kids nowadays who are also good on chess, but they're not down to earth like Arjun. Like you really root for the guy. He's such a wow. Are you, gonna, are you gonna are you gonna give us some names? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <fair>. <laughs> <laughs> there are at least two, or two I could think of. So you'll give us a number, but not the name. <laughs> Fine. Mm. No. Yeah, Magnus. I mean, Arjun plays a million openings yeah. with with both colors. It's just uh, insane. The way he scored ten out of eleven in the Olympiad is just totally insane. It's a machine. But he didn't. Play good rapid this tournament, so he's he uses all he uses all his energy so gaining <laughs> 90 points on the, <laughs> on the classical, and so he uses uh, yeah he also plays non-stop. Yeah. yeah, so I think in this event you beat two of the most talented youngsters, Arjun and Nadir Beck. So that's uh, uh, amazing. Yeah, yeah like uh, again, okay, Arjun is out of form in this event because as I said he. He used all his uh, brain to gain 90 rating points, and he maybe it's on the w- he's on his way to 2900. He just needs to get <laughs> 99 more points. But uh, yeah, I, I mean, I, I'm a big fan of uh, of Arjun. He's uh, he's a great kid. He's down to earth. He's uh, humble, and he's a very good chess player. He has a bright future ahead of him. I mean, there are some kids nowadays who are also good and chess but they're not down to earth like Arjun like you really root for the guy he's such a wow are you gonna are you gonna give us some names no (laughs) okay (laughs) 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 there are at least two or two I could think of so you'll give us a number but not the name (laughs) (laughs) at least two that pop out of my head probably yeah yeah, probably three but uh, yeah Arjun is exceptional Uh, Gukesh also and Pragnananda uh, I mean, they're they're great kids. They're very nice. You you really root for them. Yes. You know, so, um. I have one question. You know, Wesley uh, Magnus said this that out of this younger generation, he thinks it's Nordebeck who's the hungriest of them all, who's got oh. like the strongest killer instinct on the board. Would you agree with that assessment? Mm, I don't know. Well, Magnus usually knows better. I mean, <laughs> I don't really know too much about these kids because they. <laughs> like a new one pops up every six months. Yeah? <laughs> like, uh, I, but I think Gukesh also, right? Like Gukesh just keeps improving, and then in his interviews he also keeps saying, "I just want to improve, improve, improve." He's already so good; he still wants to improve. And uh, he said, "I mean, I see some of the quotes yeah, by Gukesh saying, I don't really care about predictions, all that. <laughs> I don't care about results. I just wanna, you know, be world champion." And I think, I mean, Gukesh. Probably, oh. and maybe Arjun, but Arjun is very quiet. He doesn't, he doesn't say anything. He just beats you. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, I, I mean, I, I practiced a little bit with Nodir Beck last year because we were oh. teammates in this World Rapid team yeah, with Nep, Nep, yeah, with Nepo, Badim, and uh, he told us he works ten hours a day on chess. Lotus doesn't believe it. <laughs> I, I don't believe it. Either. Well, maybe no. Maybe I could believe it. I mean, if how many hours do you practice in a day? Who oh, me? <laughs> maybe averaging one. <laughs> 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 no, I mean, okay. Well, I don't work every single day, but if I'm an up- upcoming Lotus event, is not happy with that answer. <laughs> <laughs> I just pretend to. He said, "Where do you always work on chess?" But I think it's like. Quality work time is also different. If you're just uh, browsing on Twitter, what Kramnik says, what Annie <laughs> says, then it's not really quality time. You know, like let's say you work six hours on chess, but half of it is on social media, then you only work, work three hours. But I think it's more effective when you're working on chess to cut off all internet. Oh. You know, cut off all, like put your phone away. <coughs> Now we know why we never became GM. Yes. yes. yes that explains a lot. <laughs> I mean, I can work hard, but uh, I usually have long breaks. Uh, like, uh, like, for example, January, February, uh, March generally free for me. So, uh, 
It's a lot of months. Huh? It's a lot of months. <laughs> yeah, the, the winter months are very relaxing. But when I have an upcoming event, maybe I work like two or three hours a day. Okay, so basically, should we take a look <laughs> on the women? Uh, but, but, but also, Mishra's dad, he always boasts that uh, his son works 10 hours a day and his son is only 14. And I was like, isn't that child abuse? But <laughs> we'll see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think these kids have this huge propensity to work on chess so much and they really enjoy it. Even the Indian kids and they're having fun while doing it. So yeah. Well, I guess when you get clearly works. When you get to our age, huh, then you yes. kind of relax a bit. Yeah. Yes. I also yeah. heard that this little kid, Anish Sarkar, also works really hard, like He's many three. hours. Yeah, three, or three years three. old. Three, that's three. But, amazing. So. Yeah, I don't... I find it hard to believe a three-year-old can play that well. I thought three-year-olds don't even know how to move the pieces. Like, they can't yeah, even exactly. Reach the table, right? The but rules of the he game. He can't reach the table, but he knows the moves. So. <laughs> <laughs> and he's already fifteen hundred, right? Yeah. Get younger. No, I, I still, I still don't believe how a three-year-old could play. Uh, well, I guess Faustina is already very strong. Like his chess.com rating is higher than mine. Mm. Oro. <laughs> yes, yes. Faustino, yeah, and he's only 10. That the same for every sport? Uh, I'm thinking because um, because of the internet and because of chess programs that make it accessible. That's why chess players are getting younger. Mm. But I'm not sure it applies to every sport, mm. maybe. But um, yeah, I was telling, so I told Vincent last year he's already getting old. <laughs> He's no longer a teenager. <laughs> so if you're a teenager, you better already be fighting for the world championship yeah. cycle. And he just turned tough. twenty today. Yeah, he. Oh, so today's his birthday. Yes, today's Vincent's birthday. Oh wow! Yeah. And, so uh, his, his teenage today. ended today. Ah, you <laughs> didn't know. Ah, no. Yeah, that's why he's no longer a teenager oh. today. Well, actually, we. And we you said he's too old for chess now today. <laughs> no, he's not too old for chess. Like I think. You can play at any age, but uh, I mean, it's not. I mean, you see, ten year old. Yeah, so it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. 